Tim Kosh from the Arizona Daily Wildcat here. We're the Arizona Wildcats just defeated the UCLA Bruins 27 to 13. The story of the game was the defense, which was dominant from the start. A week after getting embarrassed by Stanford on this very same field, the defense came out with a passion and aggression that we have not seen yet this year from the unit. It, it feels very good. You know, uh, uh, hey, we're all in this together. You know, the bottom line is getting wins, but you, you certainly want to hold up your end of the bargain. And, uh, and you know, we challenged our guys this week. Just play with a little tougher mindset. Yeah, just to prepare a little harder. A little, you know, and, and uh, put a little extra into it. And I was just very proud of our coaches and our, and our players. They did a nice job all week. And we came out tonight with a really strong mindset and played really hard. And it really was the defense that saved the day today for Arizona, holding UCLA to just 10 first downs and 211 yards of total offense on a day when, believe it or not, quarterback Nick Foles looked human. Nick Foles was responsible for three interceptions and two fumbles, giving Arizona five turnovers for the day, by far the highest for the year. But despite his struggles, Arizona was great on offense. I thought it was another uh, very good win uh, for us uh, to be able to, you know, overcome uh, what four or five turnovers and still win uh, pretty convincingly. Jerron Kreiner was enormous for the Wildcats today, hauling in two touchdown passes and running the ball on the ground effectively as well. He stepped up in place of a poor performance from Foles and an injured Nick Rigsby to be the number one guy for the Arizona offensive attack today. Uh, I, I think I did. I mean, I'm just doing my job. Just go out there and let my natural abilities take over. So Arizona gets a week to regroup this week as they have a bye. They have a chance to get healthy and work on some things, both on offense and defense. And then they hope to take the momentum from their two-game winning streak and turn it into three in a row, two weeks at Arizona Stadium against Washington State. For the DailyWildcat.com, this is Tim Koch.